Ladies and gentlemen, distinguished guests, on behalf of the Embassy of the Netherlands, I would like to welcome you to the opening of this exhibition entitled Walking Between Houses, which is part of the annual Mugran Photo Farm. I started working with Paul Julien's legacy about three years ago. I worked in a couple of other countries on this project, mainly uh, Liberia and Nigeria. And last year when I met Al Sadiq Mohammed, who's a Sudanese photographer, we started planning this Sudan bit of it. And we tried to connect the past as documented by Paul Julien to present day stories and places in Sudan. And that's what this exhibition shows. What you will see in the exhibition are floating stories, stories that need you to connect to them again, to what we found and what we have tried to shape in such a way that they in turn address your imagination. So now we will come to the final point to officially open this exhibition. There's uh, many places here the same is the Sudan, especially in the but I, I didn't knew them. I don't know why, but this is like a chance for me to know many things. In the Sudan are many places over there. The pictures take us into the history of Sudan, the people, the places. For example, this picture, I like the expression on the man's face. I feel really connected to this, uh, to this uh, picture. I love the stories. فلما جيت شفت الصور هنا كان في صور معها كابشن معها كلام مكتوب فالصورة دي كان اسمها شيخ العزازة الخطف الجزازة فقصة مضحكة شديد صور بتورينا التراث بتاعنا شفت حاجات جميلة الشلوخ اللي بيعملوها زمان هسا ما في يعني معرض جميل أنا حبيته كثير Al Sadiq and I still have a wish list of places to go and show people in those places the photographs, which is Wadi Halfa and Port Sudan for sure. And next to that, I am now planning other parts of the project in Ethiopia. Uh, probably Al Sadiq and I again work together. And in West Africa, I'll work with other local stakeholders and as much as possible the descendants of the people that Paul Julien photographed.